Everything you need is already inside of you. Yes, all the power, patience, integrity, love, everything you need is already inside of you. The only reason you haven't accessed it yet is one of two reasons. One, you're either too comfortable or not uncomfortable enough. Or number two, your desire and or your aim is simply too low. See, here's the hard truth. We all must first get uncomfortable in order to get comfortable. And here's why. Because whatever we desire, whatever level we want to get to requires growth. And in order to grow, you have to get uncomfortable. There's no such thing as growing while being comfortable. Case in point, you ever have a clean house? I mean spick and span, everything in place, just the way you like it. Well, when your house is so clean, you don't have a desire to clean up more, do you? No, because your house is already clean. But this is what growth does. Growth takes you on an exploration to show you that there's actually some dirt that you don't see. So therefore, you gotta dig deeper and clean more. And as a result, you have to get uncomfortable. See, most of what we desire, we've never had before. So in order to get something that you never had, yes, you gotta do something that you've never done. See, I had such a hard time with this in my life because again, I told you in my other video, I thought the world owed me something. Forget the process, forgetting uncomfortable. I've been too uncomfortable to feel I had to get uncomfortable again. My mom disowning me. Me having to fend for myself since my teenage years. Me feeling all alone, feeling like I had nobody. And then the very thing that, that I found peace in, the very thing that gave me joy, the very thing that taught me how to give love and receive love, which was the game of football, was taken from me at an early age for a few years. See, my only outlet to feel good about myself and about life was taken from me. See, I didn't just break an arm or break a finger, break a leg. No, I broke the biggest bone in my body, my femur bone. So not only was I in the hospital for three months with weights pulling my leg, trying to stretch it back to size, but then I had to go back home and I had to wear a body cast for about four to five months. And then after I got that off, I had to learn how to walk all over again. So I had to sit and suffer, not understanding why until later on, understanding that we all must first get uncomfortable in order to get comfortable. So look what I've done for you. I got three strategies in place to help you to stop resisting the process. Stop resisting the uncomfortable, difficult nature of growth. The first is this. Learn how to respect and accept the process. Understanding that it's making you better and not bitter. Acceptance will change your life. Number two, only, and I mean only, focus on your why. The very reason you're doing it. The end result, the end game, the goal, the prize. Only focus on that. Don't get caught up thinking how it's going to happen. That's not your job. And in fact, thinking too much on how it's going to happen will not allow you to make anything happen. And then number three, understand that how well we handle the lesson determines the size of the blessing. So what am I saying in short? If you cheat the lesson, you cheat the blessing. Listen, it's the most beautiful Wednesday. I'm so excited. You know why? Because not only because I'm just talking to you, but because I'm alive. Start getting excited about life.
Because guess what? You don't have to be here. So get excited because you are here. So you know what that means? There's something significant that you have to do. You know what else that means? God is not through with you yet. You know why? Because you were born to be great. So you soak it up. You believe it. You feel it. You spread it. And then you'll be great. Listen. The great mind is the mind that can simplify all things. Have a wonderful evening and understand we all must first get uncomfortable in order to get comfortable.